Hello viewers, in this tutorial I discuss about uh, techniques of analysis linear system. So there are two basic methods for analyzing the behavior or response of the linear system to a given input signal. One method is based on the direct solution of the input or output equation for the system which is general has the form like y of n equal f of y of n minus 1 y of n minus 2 dot 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 y of n minus n dot dot x of n minus n clear so in this method the main the main analysis is where f of this function where f of this function denotes some function of the quantities in bracket especially especially for an lti system for an lti system we shall see after that the general form of input and output relationship is y of n so that's the input and output relationship is y of n k equal 1 n a of k y of n minus k plus k equal 0 m b k x of n minus k clear so where a k and b k these a k and b k uh, are constant parameters the especially the system and are independent of x of n and y of n x of n and y of n so the input and output relationship is called a difference equation and represent one way to characterize the behavior of discrete time lti system and the that's the first method for analysis linear system okay and the second method for analysis the behavior of linear system to a given input signal is first to decompose or resolve the input signal into a sum of elementary signals. The elementary signals are selected so that the response of the system to each signal component is easily determined. Then using the linearity, okay, using the linearity property of the system the response of the system to the elementary signal are added to obtain the total response of the system to the given input signal the second method is one describe the section mainly to elaborate suppose that the input signal suppose that the input signal x of n is resolved into the weighted sum of the elementary signal components like x of n equal k of c k x of k n clear so where c k are the set of amplitudes in the decomposition of the signal of x of n okay and now suppose that the response of the system of the elementary signal component x k n and is y k n okay thus then x k n so he that's written as y k n equal tau x k n clear that's from this equation so in this the although to a largest extent the choice of the elementary signal appear to be arbitrary and our section is having dependent on the class of input signals that we wish to consider if we place no restriction of the characteristics of the input signal their resolution into a weighted sum of the sample sequence proved to be mathematically clear so that's the technique of analysis linear system so thank you everyone and subscribe my channel see you in next tutorial